Hello everyone, this is Paul with Creaform, and in today's video we'll take a look at how to assess corrosion damage on a pipe over time using the initial undamaged pipe as a reference. So let's get started. What you can see on the screen here is the undamaged reference pipe section and the damaged uh, pipe section. So the same section just over time accumulated some corrosion damage. So the first thing we have to do here is align the inspected mesh over top the reference mesh in order to be able to take local measurements. And I'm going to use the manual pre-alignment method in this case. So I'll anchor three point pairs and hit best fits. Okay, so there we go. That looks like a good alignment. So next step will be to create a color map from that. So I'll go ahead and click color map. And so we're using our reference mesh as the reference. And on the actual damaged pipe, I'm just going to select uh, the area of interest. So in this case, the right side of the pipe like this. And I'll hit OK. And so we can see it creates the color map in the tree. Now I'll also go ahead and edit the color map just to change the green zone boundaries to be within plus or minus 0.2 in this case. Now I'll also go ahead and add in the max and min deviations. The positive deviation I don't care so much about in this case, but the negative deviation will be an interesting number to have in the report. Now let's go ahead and also toggle the color map grid. This will be nice to have in the snapshot in addition to the maximum negative deviation. So I'll go ahead and click snapshot. And I'm also going to add a note for the report. And I'll say something like damage after six months. Okay. So if I generate the report, we should see the notes as well as the snapshots. So if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and drop us a like and consider subscribing to our Creaform channel. This was Paul and I'll see you in the next video.